Hey guys, I'm really frustrated because what is this lint? Everyone from my job watching this video being like, where are Julie's tits? Because like at work I wear like a push-up bra and I like make it, I make the straps go like all the way to here so that I have like cleavage. So like everyone's brought it like, yeah, this girl's no tits actually. But anyway, what is this? And like, let me put this down. Like, that's how I feel right now. Like, that I'm just convulsing. Because, like, I'm trying to make the solution work. Like, I don't, what do I have to individually take off each fucking thing? Whatever the fuck this is, is this not lint? Like, is this not lint? Because this is a lint roller, so, like, I'm assuming this is lint. But it's not. Like, I don't know what this is. Like, wait, let me take a little peek off. That looks like lint, does it not? But, like, like, I'm just, like, <laughs> luckily I'm wearing, I'll show you what I'm wearing. So, like, I don't think anyone will see it, but me knowing that, like, my solution didn't work is just, like, angering my soul. Like, it's making me, like, really angry. I just don't understand, like, <laughs> why. Like, what is there? Is it from the dryer? Like, what the fuck? And how have I never noticed it? Or did it just get on there? So, this is what I'm wearing. So, no one's going to, like, see. Is it from this? Because I wear it with this a lot. No. I'm gonna wear this so no one will see the lint, but like I will know in the back of my head that is there. But like whatever. I always wear this because it makes me feel so fucking cute. And like this is my cousin's, and like I don't know if she wants it back, but like I wear it every day and she hasn't said anything. So she's just like, okay, you look so cute. That's my top. And I'm like, yes, it is. And then like I wait for her to be like, can I have it back? But maybe she, like, gave it to me. That's the thing with having such a close cousin that's basically, like, your sister. You share so many clothes you don't know what's borrowed and what's given. <laughs> Why do I talk like that? Like, I was talking to somebody today that I realized I have so many different voices and so many different, like, things that I do all in one sentence. Because my ADHD is just so strong and I'm just, like, an unhinged individual. Like, maybe if I was just unhinged, I wouldn't be as weird, but I'm unhinged and I have ADHD, so it's just like a recipe for disaster. See, like, he did it again. What the fuck? What the fuck, man? And, like, what was that? Like, do I have Tourette's? And I'm not making fun of anybody with Tourette's. I genuinely question, like, what? I also took an autistic test at my doctor's office because I like genuinely wanted to know and she literally told me because I have like a ADHD, PTSD and uh, BPD there's too many things to like differentiate or whatever the word she fucking used to determine whether or not I'm autistic so she said it's still up in the cards um but we'll find out <laughs> someday I don't know if I'm autistic. It's just like I genuinely wouldn't be surprised if I was because like doctors like don't care about women. So like somebody could have told me so long ago that I was like autistic, but they just like didn't fucking give a shit. And then now I'm like 24 and I'm like, am I autistic or am I just like really fun to be around? Like what's the answer? <sighs> oh, I'm so funny and <laughs> hilarious. Like, everyone would be lucky to have me in their life. I just came from fucking Savers and I got a fucking super cute bag. And it came with a little pom-pom. And now I live my life. Like, this is my bag. I also got another bag. And guess what? Each bag were $5.99. And I looked at it and like these bitches took care of these bags because there's nothing wrong with them. So if you're watching this and this was your bag, like thanks fucking ho. Like I really needed these fucking bags. Uh, are you fucking kidding me? 5 dollars 
Like, I love my fucking life so fucking much. I got a dab pen from the dispensary. Like, I'm living my best fucking life. I look super cute. I am cute. Every day is a be the, the best day of my fucking life. Literally, some some dude is fucking some thirty year old dude is fighting with me about not calling him back, and I don't give a fuck because I just got a bag from Savers. Like that's why I didn't call you back, bitch. Like I was busy. Like get a fucking life, get a hobby. Like uh, I'm over here getting a cute fucking bag. Uh, I love my life, and now I'm gonna eat some nachos because I fucking can and I will, and I'll do whatever the fuck I want. Ow! I just hit a tree branch, and I'm almost getting hit by like various cars. Cause I'm just fucking walking around loving my life. I'm the only one in the world. I'm the main fucking character. Like, ugh, I don't give a fuck about anybody. When they make my Netflix documentary and when some ex-boyfriend murders me and decapitates my head, the whole documentary is gonna be about how I love my fucking life. And I did whatever the fuck I wanted. Like, get this bag with a pom-pom. I can do whatever I want. When I want, cause I got paid today, bitch. Like, ugh, ugh, ugh. I love my life. Nobody can fucking tear me down. There's something in my shoe. <gasps> what is this on my fucking shoe? What the fuck? Like, God hates me. Like, I'm talking about how much I love my life, and simultaneously, I'm getting fucking gunk on my fucking shoe. Like, Jesus fucking Christ. Okay. Okay, I feel better. <sighs> Life is okay again. But yeah, I got this dab pen. It's like lemon cello or something. I don't know what a lemon cello is, but I got it because I have this charger. Hey guys, so I'm in TJ Maxx right now and I'm trying to get a fucking comforter. But what if my hands feel it and then I go home and I don't like it? Like, I can't just make this huge, big decision based off of just, like, it folded up in the shelf. Like, I need to, like, really experience it. Like, this is a hard decision, guys, and I don't know if I can do it, but I'm gonna make a decision. I wonder if I could, like, return it, like, fold it back up. Like, oh, I didn't even take it out of the package. Because it's, like, zippered. So I feel like I could return it and be like, oh, I freaking hated this. But, like, this is just a hard decision that, like, only my hands can't decide. It's so hard. There's some that are, like, really soft, and then some that are, like, colorful. And I have nobody here to help me make my decision. And only I see my room. Like, do you think anyone comes to my house? No. So even if I had somebody else, they wouldn't even be able to help me. So I might make this decision tomorrow because, like... It was already a whole decision trying to get this bag at Savers. Like, I was, like, <sighs> really trying to decide. So, I think that's enough, like, brain capacity that I can handle for, like, one day. But I'm going to look and see. And if I get it, I'll show you guys what it looks like. Why does this look dirty? I just shut the video off, but it was, like, really dirty. So, I was going like this. But yeah, this is a really huge decision. So I don't know if I can make it today, but if I do, I'll show you guys what it looks like. Also, like, I look really cute today. And this lighting is really cute. So I might take some selfies, but also like who takes selfies in TJ Maxx, but also like who vlogs in TJ Maxx. Like, I don't know what I'm doing, but yeah, I'm just walking away from that shelf because like, it was just overwhelming. My hands can't decide what my body's gonna feel like. My hands can't decide what I'm gonna feel like at 2 a.m. when I'm cuddled all up, but I need to make a decision today. Like everyone in my house is gonna be like, oh, you don't have a comforter and we're gonna have to hear you to complain about a comforter 17 times. So I need to make a decision, but I just had to walk away. I could come back in like an hour and like make my decision later because I just can't make my decision now. It's just like, it's just so overwhelming for me because I don't know what I'm, what? and plus all of them said queen and king size bed and like, I didn't want to say it because there were so many people that were just around me, like probably listening to me because I'm vlogging in the middle of teacher max, but they, none of them said twin size bed. And like, I'm staying with somebody right now because I don't have my apartment. So I, need a twin size bed comforter i don't need a king or a queen but that's all that that said so i like got overwhelmed 
and like my anxiety was taking over if you couldn't tell so i'm just gonna like order it online because like i can't and i'll just look at the reviews and see how many people comment like oh my god i love this like oh my god this was so oh wait i need cuticle oil like ugh. what am i doing i need cuticle oil and i need moisturizer those are the two things that i came here for i came here for moisturizer and cuticle oil but there i am looking at comforters like this is what happens to me and I almost just left the store thinking that like I <laughs> was done with my shopping when I literally came here for cuticle oil and moisturizer. Like something's wrong with me. Like every time I think that I'm a normal person, I realize that I just make, I'm so dumb and I don't think before I do things. Like that's literally what I came here for. But maybe I'm just a girl like, oh, I got distracted. Ha. <laughs> I can't find cuticle oil, but I did find these foot masks, which I've been obsessed with lately. I love doing foot and like hand masks. Like they're like little like booties for your feet and like gloves for your hands. And then I got some booty blenders, but like I literally can't find cuticle oil and I'm gonna cry. Hey guys, I'm wearing my makeup, my mascara from last night and I'm eating some baby bell cheese. But how, does anyone else think like this? Like someone right now just died. Someone is brushing their teeth right now. Somebody just lost their virginity, like, right in this moment. Somebody, like, hates their life. And somebody loves it, you know? It's just so crazy to think about. Um, I know I'm realistically not the only one who thinks like this. But there could be a million things I could be doing right now. Like, I could be, like, cleaning my room. I could be, like, learning Spanish, getting a boyfriend. Like, I could be doing all these things. But instead, I'm just like, oh, my God, someone bought a parrot. Like, someone right now just named their first cat. What did they name it? I want to know. Like, I just, like, someone just had a breakup. And then I think, like, oh, my God, I hate my life and I want to, like, jump into in front of a car, <laughs> which I've done before. But then other times I'm like, you know, it's just not worth it. Like, someone else probably hates their life more than me. Someone just died. Like, you know? Like, someone just lost their grandma to, like, cancer. And I can't find my vape charger and I'm wondering why I'm alive. No, I'm just kidding. Like, I have actual problems, too. As you guys know, because I talk about them often. Um, and there's even problems I don't talk about. So, like, I'm I'm just kidding about the vape charger, but that really would piss me off. But, like, not want to die, you know what I mean? I'm just being psychotic. But I, I just, like, genuinely think about that. <sighs> but, yeah, I have therapy soon. Um, this is all I had to say today. Like, <laughs> I just think about things like somebody's putting deodorant on. Someone just got their first car. Oh, like, I don't know. Someone's asking someone to prom. Wait, it's like October. Like, I need to get a life. Like, there's 18 things I need to do. Like, my to-do list is to-doing. And I'm sitting. Like, <laughs> but I have therapy. So, like, I have to, I had to focus on, like, getting ready for that. It's on Zoom, so, like, I wear my pajamas. But, like, there was a lot of getting ready in the process, mentally, okay? Just, like, I could have learned Spanish this morning. I could have, you know, did the dishes. I could have vacuumed. I'm just going to do that after therapy. No, I'm not. <laughs>